Hi guys, it's Jessie, and today I thought I would do just a really um, kind of, I guess, small e.l.f. haul. And if you don't know what the e.l.f. products are, they're the Eyes, Lips, Face. And I ordered mine off of um, eyeslipsface.com. And everything you can get from there, I think that some people have said that um, Target carries a large variety of all their products. Um, I know my local dollar store carries some of the dollar items, but... In order for me to get any of the other items, I have to order them online. And I had a coupon for 50% um, off, so uh, I decided I'd probably better use it before it expires. So I guess I'll start with the stuff that I got in the dollar line. And um, the first things I got are nail polishes, and I got four of them. And uh, I tried some of these in the past and really liked them. The one in Sunset is kind of a, kind of a lilac color. I really like it. And so, since they were 50% off and they were only 50 cents a piece, I thought I'll go ahead and order a few more. The first one is um, Punk Purple, which is just kind of a, hopefully this will show what it looks like. I'm having some lighting troubles. But um, it's just a really pretty kind of mauve purple color. The next one, and there's been a lot of people that really like this one here on YouTube, and this one's the coral one. My little girl absolutely loves this one. The next one is Cranberry, and it's just a dark berry color with, I don't know if you're going to be able to see it or not, with some shimmer in it. The next one is in Red Velvet, and it's kind of a brighter red with um, some shimmers to it. So those are all the nail polishes I got. Another item in the dollar line, which um, is one of their new um, products, and it's their Healthy Glow Bronzing Powder, and this one's in Luminous. It look, comes in a case like this. Hopefully you'll be able to see it. And it, these are actually, if I can get it open, so it looks like this. And these are so soft. Hopefully you'll be able to see that. But this one it looks really pretty on. I don't know, I'll rub it on my hand, but I don't know if you'll be able to see it with a lot, the way my light is. But I uh, really like that one. And then um, another item that was one of their new items in the dollar line, and it's the Zit Zapper. And this one, um, I threw the package away. I guess I shouldn't have done that. But it has salicylic acid, witch hazel, and uh, green tea extract to help with um, acne. And this one's just got the little roller ball on it. I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not, the way the light is there. But... Uh, I haven't tried this, so I don't know if it works or not. Um, another item that I got in the dollar line were the All Over Color Sticks. And I've got several of these. I just, every time I order, I get a couple more till I have all of them. But this one is in Toasted. I don't, I'll roll it up. They kind of come in a little, they roll up. I'll try to rub it on. It's kind of a bronzy color. I don't know if you'll be able to see it there be able to see that one. And then another one I got is in Persimmon, which is kind of a pink with gold undertone. Let's see if I can rub it on here without getting too much on my hand. I don't know if you'll be able to see it. It's on the bottom, if you can see it. Those are in the dollar line. And then another item that I got in the dollar line, I got three of these. These are there, and I've never used these before, and I was just kind of curious about them. They're waterproof eyeliner pen, and they come with like the little felt tip marker on it. And this one is in coffee. Let me see. Do a swatch. There's the coffee one, which is brown. Let's see. The next one is in midnight, which is a really dark blue. It almost looks kind of black. This is this one on the bottom. And then the other one I got was in Plum, and it looks just kind of looks kind of black too. They look more true to color after they dry. So that one is the Plum one on the bottom. Let's see, did I get anything else in the dollar line? Oh, and I did get um, their, one of their brushes, and it's the Professional Blending Eye Brush, which looks like this. And this brush, I'm going to have to say, I ordered um, their blending brush three, four years ago, and it kind of just had like um, kind of orangish 
red and black bristles in it. It was really, really, I don't know, it was rough. So this brush has come a long way over the years, and this one is really good for a crease brush, is what I used it for the other day, and I really like it. Um, the other things I got, I didn't get any of the mineral things this time. I thought about it, and then I decided not to. So I went ahead and got uh, a few things out of the studio line, and I've been kind of gradually, I guess, every time I order, I get... Um, another brush out of the studio line because I really like their brushes and I think they're really good quality and I've been happy with every brush I've gotten so far out of the studio line. So I got one brush this time and it was the e.l.f. eyeshadow C brush which looks like this. And this one um, is actually I think a lot better quality than the one that is in the dollar line. I like the one in the dollar line and I have several of them. They just tend to shed so this one feels like it's a lot sturdier, so we'll see how this one goes. I haven't used it yet. Another item that I got uh, out of the studio line, and it was the e.l.f. Lip Definer and Shaper, which looks like this, and it's double-ended. And one end is the define end, like this, and it's kind of like a subtle pink nude color. And this end is the nude, the shape side. Right there, if you'll see. And it comes with a little, little sharpener in the cap, which I thought was really kind of nice. So I got that one. And then I decided um, they had a couple new blush colors that I hadn't tried. And I've got um, one, and I think it's Tickled Pink, I think is the name of it, I think. I'm not good with names. But anyway, um, the first one I got was um, their new one, which is in Gotta Glow. Yeah, got a glow. Sorry, my eyes aren't real great. And it looks like this, and I hope you'll be able to see it. Um, it's just a really light color, and I think you could use this one as a blush. I mean, there it is, right there. Kind of a subtle blush. You can mix it with other blushes. It's got a subtle sheen to it. You could use it as um, eyeshadow. I think you could use it as a highlighter. I mean, I think this one would be kind of like a little multitasker. The other one that I got that I was, um, the reviews on there were really good, and this one is in Candid Coral, which looks like this. Hopefully you'll be able to see it. To me, it's not really a coral. It's more of a darker kind of pinkish peach color, but this one is really, really pretty. I was really happy with this color, if you can see it. I don't know if you'll be able to or not. Like I said, the lighting is cruddy today, but, uh, these were $3. The studio line stuff was all $3, and then I had the 50% off coupon. So $1.50 for each of the items. And I was really happy, like I said, with this one. It looked really pretty on. So these are all the items that I got from Eyes, Lips, Face. Um, their shipping, it took about a week and a half, two weeks to get my stuff. So that was how long the shipping was. So I guess not real fast, but not the worst in the world. And if you have any questions or comments about any of the products that I showed you, just leave them in the comment box and I'll get back to you. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.